Hey everyone, this is Cody from Bed Agri Health Services. I am doing a tutorial today on Module 1 of our CalCalf software program, CalfBook. So I will log in into CalfBook now. So this is the home screen and what we will be doing in Module 1 is we will be adding a brand new animal and in this time we will be doing a calf entry so we select add animal calf entry we then select that animal CCIA tag these can be either preloaded typed in or we can use a Bluetooth RFID reader and it will automatically pop into the space when it's scanned type in that calf's number so we'll say this is calf number 1B we select the calf's dam, so in this case we will pick dam number 4. And we can add additional information. So this is just the basics here and then we'll do another calf with more advanced information. So we'll pick that this is a bull calf. This calf was born alive. It defaults to today's date, but this can be changed to either a day before, day after, you can pick whichever date you want whether or not the animal was castrated or dehorned and you can pick the herd location or subgroup of this animal and then all you do is save and it'll ask you if you want to add another animal so we'll pick yes once again we'll pick a new CCIA tag number we'll pick animal 2B to add advanced information to We'll select this calf's dam, so we'll pick 5W. Gender, let's pick a heifer this time. Now we'll go to advanced information. Birth weight, so let's say this heifer weighed 100 pounds. We can say this is either an actual birth weight or an estimated calving ease. Unassisted. Cow alert, so cow alert just tells us any additional information we want to know about that cow and the next time she comes through the chute or through the system, uh, she will have a flag that whatever we're flagging her for on this cow alert. So let's say she had a poor udder at time of calving, so next time she comes through she'll come up as a poor udder and we can make a decision on whether or not we could call her or not. Breed, we'll pick our breed lots to choose from fully customizable color and any additional information you would like to add you press save it asks you if you want to add another animal we'll select no this time and that was it module one how to add a calf into bed health calf book